Taylor Treasure. Thanks for joining Hello. us. Hello. Thanks for coming back again. So I am nervous, but I'm excited for this episode. I'm, I'm wondering Why how it's going to go. Well, <laughs> what's there to be nervous about? Well, you'll see. So I don't know if you guys know this, but I am the meme queen. I'm the queen of memes. She's the connoisseur of all memes. I Half my life is memes. You should see my phone. It's like well, 2,000 memes. Well, I don't know. Memes. You and Nathaniel are a tie because mm. you both... Who's the king of memes. of memes? I'm the queen of memes, so but I still get the sister, title. So that's a little weird, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> We're from different. No, I was gonna say different counties. <laughs> different You're counties the queen of, of the county. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so I love memes, and I have a whole bunch. And I thought for this episode originally, I'm like, well, how about I just get some memes for Laura to react to because she likes memes, but she's not into them as much as me and our brother Nathaniel. I like and I enjoy seeing them, but yes. I have no idea how you go about acquiring them. I mm. just see them places. Yeah. So I thought I'm gonna get some memes that she's gonna react to, but then I thought I share like all of them on Snapchat, so she's seen like all of the good ones. So. Yep. I took it a step further and I made my first own original memes. How about that? Yes. So I'm nervous because you may not laugh at any of them. I don't know. It's my first try. So I have these memes here and pretty much that's the show today is just to have her react to them and see if maybe I can have a career in meme making. I don't know. We'll have to see. But uh, we'll get out. started. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right. Let's I can't go. Wait. Let's do this. Number one. Here we go. All right. YouTube premium. YouTube and YouTube. Oh, yeah, those ads. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty funny. <laughs> so, yep. That's yeah. so true. Oh. Because you're like, I don't want I it. I don't care. Stop <sighs> asking me. I don't want YouTube premium. I want to listen to the ads. It's right. my decision. Stop it. I, whenever I try to listen to an album of music on YouTube, I'm like, just let me listen. But yeah, that one really gets me. I cannot stand. Because they do ads. it every five seconds. I know. You're like, I just well, YouTube, answered this. It used, it's turned into, because it's like a company now it's turned into pretty much tv like there's so many ads it's ridiculous it used to be i remember when it yeah, used to be like, like watching a tv station now yeah it's ridiculous but um all right that's funny okay how about okay how about you rate them one to ten ten being the best each time what do you okay think? i will give this one an eight eight okay that's pretty good and she's not like she will enjoy them more than you may think she's not gonna like crack up even if she really likes them so a fair warning. I, yeah, I'm not so exuberant. But no. I do think they're funny. Right. Okay. Uh, number two. This one's very personal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that one's funny. <laughs> it's so true. <laughs> yes. Yeah. That's uh, me. Every time, we're like walking and we'll be like, there'll be a dog. Like It's like a speck and she's like, oh, look at the doggy! And she's like, go over and pet it. <laughs> Because, how can you not? I mean, come on, it's there, it wants attention, you know it. Uh-huh, okay, well, yeah. uh, what, what, a good one. What, what's your rating? That's a 10. 10, okay. A 10 on that yeah, one. good, I actually got a real crack up out of that. Okay, number three. Sparks <laughs> See, this just makes me angry. <laughs> so yes, I agree with this one. <laughs> this one does not spark joy. <laughs> This one does not spark joy. <laughs> that is very true. Uh, yes, I'd, I'd say it's more like, I don't know, clever or something. It's not like a crack up meme, but it's like, yes, I understand. I'm it's with you. one you, you can relate to. Yes, There's very some relatable. memes that aren't necessarily yeah. funny, but they're relatable. This is very relatable. Yeah. And I'm sorry if this offends you. We're not a big fan of the sequel trilogy. Uh, you can, It's okay if you like it, but we personally you know did what? not like just it. Just knock it into no. it. Because it really be hurts all day. Yeah. So we're just going to stop it right we now. We just need to stop. Stop. Okay, moving on. Uh, next one. I didn't rate it yet. Oh yeah, what's your rating? Uh, six. Six? Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I've always wondered, like, how is the person who prints this sign not like that? Yeah. Like, <laughs> I know, it's so... I'm st I am I don't know the story behind this sign. I found it a while ago. I don't understand. It might... Maybe it's like... Like there's two lanes and you have to be in a certain one. Or it means like that this is how you get into the building, but you're not supposed to enter driving, but it still doesn't make sense. No. You just have a do not enter driving sign. I know. It makes total there's just no sense to it. Uh but that's actually one of our signs. If you follow us on Instagram, we do a funny sign. Tuesday. Funny sign Tuesday. Yeah. Every Tuesday we've got we're up to a whole bunch now. We're not stopping. That one gets a seven. Seven? Okay. This one's kinda small. Make a sequel, no one is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, burns. Uh, 
It's so That's true. Funny. This isn't even just about Star Wars. It's just like any any movie these days. Like there, if you go back even not too long ago, there weren't a whole lot of remakes. I mean, there were. There were like Jaws and stuff like that, but mm -hmm. it wasn't a whole lot. There were a lot of original movies. Now it's like number two, number three, number fifty three. Like <laughs> I know you're just like just stop. No yeah. one wants a sequel. Like I'm honestly a little concerned about the Enchanted sequel because mm -hmm. Enchanted is an amazing movie. Yeah. I love that movie. It's a good movie. Why did we need a second one? It had an ending. I know. So they got married. She had found her prince here. They went back to Cartoon Land and had a happy life. What? We and don't you, need a sequel. And you know, you know, everything's gonna be horrible in that movie. Everything's gonna be mix, mixed up. Everything, no. Well, because if it's after. still happy, there'd be no like plot. So something has to go wrong. And right. I don't want it to go wrong because Amy <laughs> Adams was happy. I know. And easy okay, money. Now, there are some sequels that there, are. Good. There really are, yeah. There are. There are. And maybe Enchanted will blow it out of the water because. Yeah. Maybe they will. Uh, what's your rating? Uh, six. Six? Okay. Someone says to me, I have something to tell you about Toyota. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> You're like, it has to be, like, something horrible. No. What did I do? Did I offend you somehow? Or did something catastrophic happen? Yeah. It always go for me, it always goes to, like, like death or something. Which doesn't make sense because they would probably tell you right then and there if it was. <laughs> but Well, because you know that people don't want to, like give you bad news all at once, they want to like bring it on gradually, so you're just expecting it's gonna be horrible. Right. This one was good. Uh, I'll give it an eight. An eight? Okay. Alright. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, it's so true. My Our mom. mom's <laughs> inbox. Oh. I think it's a lot of moms, but like she has, she had like Yahoo and then she had AOL slash Verizon. She has Outlook. And I know there's other ones that she has that she, she hasn't has a gone Gmail. into. Oh I'll yeah, Gmail too. No, Gmail isn't, it's kind of not, she's not using that one. But it is funny because this, her most recent one is the Outlook. And then she had AOL first and AOL, it's up to like 500,000 like emails. Maybe a She'll million, never, I don't know. <laughs> no, but she's like, okay. This one, this is my junk one. This is the one that I'm gonna keep all like the uh -huh. stuff I don't need. And then you look at her outlook. I will give her credit. It's not as bad as the AOL, but it's still pretty full. And it's because she subscribes to like CBS and, and all sorts of stuff. Yeah, <laughs> and like you have to take, cause I did it at one point. You have to go in, you have to go scroll to the bottom, click the un unsubscribe button. They make it, it takes so you small. to their thing. And then you have to type in your email and then you have to tell them why you're stopping. And you're like, just let me stop. And it's like, <laughs> oh, what, what is causing you to not want oh, us have to you, spam your email inbox? Have you gotten the, um, the sad puppy face whenever you unsubscribe? I've gotten that several times. No, but it, I do find it funny. They're always like, you can always come back and change your account settings. <laughs> what person has ever yeah. unsubscribed and then said, you know what? I really miss all those emails. I'm gonna go into my account yeah, and change it right. back. No <laughs> one's ever done that. No, no, it's just... But also I've learned with unsubscribing, certain places, uh, not all of them, but certain places you have to do it at least three times before they'll actually stop sending yeah. emails. You have to keep up on it and be like, okay, this is number two unsubscribing. Yeah. <laughs> but moms don't have time, so it right. just builds up. It does. <laughs> what's, your, what's your rating? Um, eight. Eight, okay, that's a good one. All right. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh, I know I know that maybe you're a friends fan out there again. It's okay if you like it. But we it personally doesn't matter if you are. Because yeah, because they're right. It's true. They laugh every two <laughs> I seconds. Know. And like usually I feel like they're worse though. A lot of nineties things, like people would laugh a lot. Maybe if you used to like put it next to Seinfeld, like they were usually pretty good at laughing at just the funny stuff. Well they could have the characters have a conversation. Right. Friends, and this they one, can't even have no, a conversation. No, they say it's like every three words there's a laugh and it's like, why did you even laugh at that part? <laughs> but uh yeah, so that's that's I never got weird. friends. I don't I don't get it. No, some people I know. A lot of people like it. They even had the reunion. It's like a cult following. Yeah, I don't, but I, I I've tried. I just it doesn't appeal to me. I don't find it funny. Uh, okay. Oh, oh, what you reading? Seven. Seven. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> what? Where did you even find that? <laughs> just online. <laughs> Breathing oxygen linked to staying alive. <laughs> well, good job. There you go. Good job that, figuring that out. Yeah. Nice work. Wow. <laughs> they even had a whole, whole article about it. <laughs> I can't see what it says, but uh, somehow they went on about how oxygen it's, it's not even alive. It's not even saying that it does. It's only linked to it. It's <laughs> oh, yeah. linked link. to staying alive. Link to Doesn't staying mean that alive. it will or won't. They're just <laughs> linking it to that. <laughs> right. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. What's your, what's your rating? Uh, give that one a seven. Okay. 
<laughs> no, I never will. No. <laughs> it's uh, wishful thinking. Never gonna open happen. the door for a 96th time. Oh my gosh, our cat Eddie. Oh. He's like, let me in, let me in. She's like, okay, Eddie. And you open the door and you let him in. And then he, it's like, literally, I've seen him eat two pieces of food. <laughs> he runs over the door. I have to get out! <laughs> he bangs on it. And you're like, you came in here to eat two pieces of food and now you're dying. I know. Okay. I, I will say he's not as bad as he used to be at night because at night he used to, um, every night you would wake up, it'd be, it could be three in the morning or something. And he'd be, he, you can get under our door because it doesn't come to the ground enough. So bang, bang. Bang! Bang! Because he knew it would make noise. And then, and then if you if we tricked him out of it for a little while because we put a towel so that in between so that he couldn't move the door. Yeah, there wasn't. It was like very tight. So right. even when he tried, it wouldn't really make noise. Yes. Yeah. Oh, and it killed him. But he, he was so <laughs> mad. <laughs> you would hear. Rah, 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 uh -huh. And then Losing and then I have mind. I have a box next to it that he would just scratch at. So he was just as annoying. It didn't work. <laughs> I don't know what, I don't know he, why that's a thing with cats. I, I don't know. know. I don't know. They just, because they're not in control. Yeah. They're stuck in a room that they didn't want to be in. <laughs> Even though they chose changed. to come in here but in the first place. But the thing is, they chose that three minutes ago. <laughs> this is now minute three, and they have a different plan, and you're right. messing it up. So open the door. Yeah. Uh, comment below if your cat does this too, because I feel like uh, not many cats do that. Also, my other cat, Lucy, she she's like almost like a permanent kitten. She doesn't act like a cat. Like, she's just very, like, sweet all the time surprisingly and she always wants to be where I am but we'll have days where she consistently makes the wrong choice like I'll be in my room and I'll hear her making noise and then I'll be like oh I forgot this and I'll go out to get something and I'll she'll run in and I'll close the door and then I'll be outside and I'll hear and then I'll be like oh wait I forgot my computer and I'll go into my, get my computer and do something and she runs out and I close the door and then she's outside she picks the wrong side like the whole time uh what's your rating for this one 10 10 okay I got two tens, yay! Oh, this is the last one. Then go to the side. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're like, wait! Oh. I don't know what it was. <laughs> and sometimes, sometimes I will try my darndest. I'll be running. Be like, wait! Uh -huh. I don't know. <laughs> Your face is great because it's like, yeah. Oh, 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 no. <laughs> I'm in a situation now. I don't know what to do. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I think that was the last one. No, it was one more. Okay. Um, oh yeah. What's your rating? I'll for? give that a eight. Eight. Oh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> That was in our funny sign Tuesday. It's one of my favorites. Abby, you need to show up for work. Abby, get on it. Which is funny because don't you think she'd be as far away as possible from that sign? <laughs> so it's like the last thing you'd want to do. Well, they probably made it so that all her employees could like take a picture of and be like, hey, Abby, look. You're right. <laughs> Gotta go into work. Yeah, yeah, that's true. All right, I think that's the last one. Uh, what's your rating? Mm -hmm. Seven. Seven? Okay. So that was, that was a success. Yay. I would say those were some good memes. I did a good job. Thank you. Do yeah. you have like a <laughs> meme creator that you made them in? I used Be Funky. Okay. It's not it's not really a meme creator. I don't use Be Fun uh, Funky Plus because it's money. So I'm I'm limited. Uh but anyways, hope you have enjoyed these memes. Um Yes. Yes, and comment down below if you'd like me to make more, because it was a lot of fun. And now it is time for the memes. folks she was there a second ago and now it's a broom <gasps> okay gotta collect myself <clears throat> gotta give you the news so <clears throat> i was today years old when i realized that the united states postal services decal or brand logo whatever you call it is an eagle on another note what did the icing and the cake say when a bagel knocked on their door to attend a party? They said, Donut, let him in! <sighs> what? You're... 
you're alive. What are you talking about? Well, there was, you turned into a broom. There was a curse on you or something. Oh. Oh, this? Yeah, I mean, I guess, I guess Jerry the janitor must have left it here when he was cleaning. I just went to the bathroom. Why would Jerry put a broom next to me? He, he knows how I am about this stuff. He knows I would have assumed that was you turned into a broom. <laughs> time for the Taylor Treasure Box! Hi, do we have new ones? No! That was a little aggressive, sorry. Story words. I have to tell one truth and one lie. Alright, my one truth and one lie is, it's not really one truth and one lie, but uh, a few weeks ago, I either did or did not say something very embarrassing to a Amazon uh, worker. You obviously did. Yes, I did. I just <laughs> want to tell the story. <laughs> so, I saw, I don't know, I do these things, I don't just, okay. So, uh, it's called being a teenager. Yeah. I, embarrassment follows me, let me tell you. But, uh, so. You're only embarrassed if you choose to be embarrassed by something. Just saying. But, so I was walking my dog, and there was a post, not a post worker, an Amazon worker who got out when we were walking by, and she came over to pet him, and people usually really like him because he likes people, and he's really adorable. Uh, not to brag, but... Uh, Insert picture of Sally. <gasps> Sally! He's just so cute. Sally Isn't that you can't not like him? But anyways, so uh, she said that she had a not nice experience with a, I believe it was a Yorkie just before that, and she's like, so you really made my day. And, uh, and I responded with, I'm happy. I just said I'm happy. Like, I just exclaimed an emotion. Not, oh, that's really gla great, great, or, or I'm glad, or that's anything so else. That's though, because you're saying you're happy that you made her happy. I know. But it just it, usually it came say, off weird. Yeah. Usually you would say, I'm glad. Yeah, I'm just, glad. You inserted happy, which is different, <laughs> but it different. still works. Yeah. I'm happy. But, uh, yeah. So I walked away in embarrassment, so... Probably shouldn't have been embarrassed. I know it's something very little, but uh, I was like, ugh, why did I say that? Uh, <laughs> so there's my... I will haunt you for the next 13 years. Yep, it will. Okay, I have story words, and they are jumbo glasses. <clears throat> so there once was a professor, and this professor was called to an amusement park of all the weird things. He didn't really know why he was called there, but he was called and it was kind of a whole hush-hush thing. They did not want people to know that this professor was being called. And they called him and they said, hey, we need you to make something very large and it has to be magnifying. He was like, okay, so you want a big magnifying glass? They're like, no, we want like two big magnifying glasses. I thought, oh, okay, that's weird. And they were like, can you put them together and then add like extensions on the sides? Or and he was like, so you mean you want glasses? And they said, no, no, no. We want just two big magnifying glasses glued together. It's like, okay. So he went home and he made it and he brought it back and he's like, these are glasses, right? What you want? And they're like, no, they're not glasses, but, but thanks. And he left. And then he realized later that he had been to none other than Jurassic Park. He was a professor, so he didn't know where he was going. He just drove up. And um, later that day, he saw on the internet a photo of the Tyrannosaurus Rex. He had been spotted eating his dinner, and he was wearing the giant glasses. And apparently, he was very self-conscious about his eyesight, and he didn't want anyone to know, which is why they were keeping it so hush-hush-hush, and they didn't want to call them glasses, because he had downright refused. The T-Rex said, I'm not wearing glasses, no. I will look like a nerd. I am not going to be the nerdy T-Rex. understandable. So they gave him large magnifying glasses and we'll, you know, we'll, we'll hope he's okay because I think his pride was a little hurt by the internet, mm -hmm. but people were still supportive. So there you go. Well, there you go. That's it. It's his jumbo magnifying glasses. Mm -hmm. They are not just glasses. They, they are, are magnifying glasses. No, no. 
So that's, I didn't know where you were going with that, but <laughs> there you go. You got to it. Got to it in the end. So there you go. Uh, so we hope you've enjoyed this episode. Um, again, comment down below on if you'd like us to do the memes again. You can also uh, give this video a like and a comment and you can subscribe. And after you subscribe, make sure to press the bell to get all of our videos in the notifications box. And you can also follow us on Instagram, which is at Taylor Treasures Official. And we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye. Oh, <laughs>